the Lexington Catholic family is mourning the loss of two students today following a car wreck on a Scott County Road late last night. LAX 18's Michael Burke joins us now live from that scene and has more on what we know at this point. It's our big story today at noon. Well, Chris, police will be releasing the names of the victims shortly. Here's what we do know. Two cars were involved here on Carrick Pike. Five people total were involved and two students were killed on the scene after this wreck shortly after 10 p.m. last night. Sheriff's office says the students were heading eastbound here on Carrick Pike and the other vehicle involved was heading westbound. The students were likely traveling at a high rate of speed and when they came over the small hill behind me, they clipped an oncoming vehicle, lost control, and then likely overcorrected losing control of the car before landing in a ditch. Four students, one from Bryan Station High, were in the car at the time, and the parents of both Lexington Catholic students who were killed are meeting now at the Scott County Coroner so they can learn exactly what happened here last night. But from the very beginning, police have been saying they don't think alcohol was involved in this. Right off the, the face of what, what we see here on the scene, the marks on the road um, that tell us kind of what happened, it looks like the vehicle was at traveling at a rate that once they met another vehicle, they didn't have time to react um, and slow down and get by that vehicle safely. Lexington Catholic, again, that's where three of the four students involved attended school released a statement reading, we are devastated by this news. We are praying together as a community and for each of the students' families who are involved. We will continue to update this story as we get more information. Again, the coroner expected to release names shortly. Uh, the Lexington Catholic School just issued a second statement indicating that on-campus counseling, uh, even though we're now in summer school, will be available to students in the Highmark building. Use entrance F. It starts right now at 12 noon. Uh, will be available throughout most of the day. Counselors and priests will be on hand to help students and their families, again, if you knew these victims and are grieving their loss. Live in Scott County, I'm Michael Burke, LEX 18 News.